हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू क्रिएटिव मेडिसिन इन दिस लेक्चर वी विल लर्न अबाउट now in the dysphagia lusoria what are the clinical features we will see now in this in this uh, uh, video we'll see the clinical features sorry clinical features of dysphagia lusoria then how we how do we diagnose the dys dysphagia lusoria and even the treatment of dysphagia lusoria at, will be dealt now so clinical features of dysphagia lusoria so now in the dysphagia lusoria because the vascular anomaly whichever is there it starts causing compression of the esophagus thus resulting in dysphagia in the patient now sometimes it might even uh, cause because of uh, uh, dysphagia sometimes even the uh, recurrent respiratory infections can also occur in the patient with difficulty in breathing can also occur due to the vascular anomalies then sometimes the patient so this is clinical features then if you see the diagnosis of the dysphagia lusoria in the diagnosis um, okay in the diagnosis one important thing is you should do a barium swallow in the barium swallow you will see that there is an extrinsic anterior or posterior compression of esophagus is seen that means actually if this is the esophagus and this is compressed by some anomaly okay by some vascular anomaly is actually compressing this part of esophagus in such cases if you do a barium swallow this part will be normal but this part will be something like this which is kinked because of the compression and again it will be normal so this extrinsic either it this type of kinking or this type of compression mark can occur either in the anteriorly or posteriorly depending upon the site of compression of the esophagus so this is seen on the barium swallow then you can also do an angiography or high resolution ct scan can be done mainly to the identification mainly for the identification of the anomaly then treatment the treatment of the patient is further treatment we should do if the patient is symptomatic then either it is a vascular rings or pulmonary rings both of them should be repaired if the patient is symptomatic so dysphagia so has a result once you re repair the vascular rings or pulmonary artery rings then dysphagia resolves in 100% of times that is in each and every case the dysphagia which occurs here will resolve after repair Thank you and thank you for watching.